Well, welcome everybody. You join us here for our coverage of what is set to be a truly exciting final. Formalities are underway, everybody is soaking up an energetic, highly charged atmosphere within the ground. The teams will be with us very shortly. We look forward, of course, to that special moment. In the meantime, we take in the feeling of excitement and euphoria ahead of what should be a really outstanding final. Unmistakably, this is the Camp Nou, staging a game in the way only the Camp Nou can. And we rise now for the English national anthem. Two teams, Jim Beglin, with one common thought, to have their names on this famous trophy. Bringing back memories for me, Peter, a chance to have your name in the club's history. Having had the privilege of experiencing this uh, a fair few times in my own career, there really is nothing that compares. Once you get there, you want to keep coming back. I still feel like that now. The final gets on the way. Look, we can only hope for a final that will be free-flowing and end-to-end -end and, and highly entertaining, but fear of defeat can often dominate emotions, so don't be surprised if it gets nervy and tense. Delivers a cross. Cleared away. Chilwell. Sancho. And here's Kane, and it's Henderson. Out to the left it goes. In with a header! A oh, great save, real class. The keeper really dug out his defence then, a magnificent effort. They've played it short. Rice pumps it into the area. And he certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Anything noteworthy in the early part of the match, Jim? Well, I think both teams probably feel it's it's too early for either to start taking real risks. So they're still very much in a phase of, of testing the waters and, and sizing each other up. No goals as yet. Henderson with a good steal, well played. Breaks on here. Tries lifting it over. That's a pop! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, as test goalkeeper, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. Hoists it forward. And it's played forward. Henderson. And here's Kane. Lovely feet. Kane! Kane really just wasn't quick enough then. Well, his thinking certainly wasn't. Didn't make use of what I felt were some very good options. Plays it out to the wing. Maguire gets into the right position to intercept. He could have been in, just needed a better final ball. Ah, quality deserted them when they really needed it. 
It's a loose ball. He's had a shot. Oh, just lacked a decent finish. England are looking quite mean on the counter, and combating that requires even more meanness. Forward it goes. Still waiting for the first goal. Oh, that is lovely footwork. He's left his man. Maguire gets it away. Sancho. And he's on his way. Just brushed off the ball there. Dashing forward at pace. Oh, shooting chance! And he's found the net! That could turn out to be a big, big goal. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. And they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. Big occasion. Whistle's gone, and we've reached the halfway point of the final. And there we are, off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Half time in the final, Jim. How do you read it? Well, it's obvious who's likely to be more content going in at half time, but I sincerely hope that there's a, a fitting response from the opposition to really engage us on the big occasion. Leading 1-0 at the break. And we're already back on the way here. Well, it's been tight, Peter, but I'm expecting things to, to open up now and we get some free-flowing football. Has a pop! Oh, denied! Brilliantly! Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Maguire goes looking. Gets it back. Looking cross field, changing the point of attack. Over to the left. Tries to get it forward quickly. He's got away. Rice, very firm in standing his ground there. It is a tough full contact contest. And the through ball is intercepted. It's on a play, going for goal! And it's played forward. A real chance to break. Now it's Sterling. He's through, now is he in? England showing a little more urgency now, and to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. And Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Just has to be done. Rice. Rice plays it forward. And he's surging through. England are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. And that's going to be a booking.
Forward it goes. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Nicely controlled. He's gone for it! Oh, that was no routine save. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra-sharp. England making consecutive changes here. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's, it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honour shift. Hoists it forward. Across the field it goes. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. And he's straight offside. Great strength. Chance! And the referee brings it to a close. And so the moment has come. The trophy shimmers as they prepare to receive it. A never-to-be-forgotten moment. What a moment this is for all connected with the team. It's a day for pride, a day for glory. Another grand chapter to be added to their glittering history.